What's up everyone? It's Sydney and this is your 30 minute unilateral legs workout. So grab some dumbbells and let's get started. What's up everyone? I'm so excited to be here with you today for our unilateral legs workout. And that means just one leg is gonna be working at a time today. We're gonna be working antagonistic muscles, meaning we'll have one exercise that is quad dominant. The other exercise will be for our posterior chain, for our hamstrings and our glutes. I do have my bench out here today for a split squat, so go ahead and make sure you have yours out, and my water, and I also have my sweat towel and a yoga block if you have one with an elevated split squat option. So if you have a yoga block or something that you can just lift your heel up with a little bit, go ahead and grab that too, okay? Dumbbells won't be too, too heavy today. Something from a deadlift for 30 seconds, three rounds, which will probably be 35 for myself, all the way down to a single leg squat pulse around the 15 or 20 pound range for myself. So pick weights that you can rock with for 30 seconds. This is all about holding that time under tension. All right, also as you've noticed, I've got my second outfit on from the Royal Change Collection. This is the Sapphire Strappy Sports Bra and the four inch inseam shorts. So I'll be rocking those today. You can kind of see how they work in workouts. This is our lower support sports bra. There's no jumping today. So this is perfect for today's strength workout. All right, let's go and get into your warm up. Butt kicks in three, two, one, let's go. Great job, we'll warm up the quads, the hamstrings, and we'll get a little bit of ankle mobility in before we start. Good job, three, two, and one. Good, grab one leg and pull, and just hold for two seconds before you switch. Great job. In today's workout, I want you to really focus on making sure that your core is engaged. Your hips and your shoulders stay level. Anytime we shift a weight to one side of our body, it's easy for our hips to shift or our shoulders to drop, okay? Wide stance, let's glide left and right. So that is a big part of unilateral training, just making sure your core is always engaged. Good job. Because it is day number two of boot camp week, we'll be rocking in two exercises at a time format. 30 seconds for one, and then 30 seconds for the other. Three rounds. Good, come right in the front, hinge forward. Great job, turn your body over to face the right side. Both legs are straight. Drive your heel down in the back for a good calf stretch. And come on up to the front, drop it down, opening up the hip. Good, up. And down. And we'll go one more time through this and then we'll switch legs, same warm up movement. And down. Good job, take it back. Just hit the calf first, so heel down. Leaning away from that calf. Great job, drop it down. And up. Back down. And up. Good job, step it up wide with both feet, drop your hips down, chest is up. And make your way through some squats. And we'll get started with circuit one in just about 30 seconds. With a single leg front squat and then a deadlift. Both of those exercises will be rocking, focusing on the right leg. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. Single leg squat. Working on the right leg, this is where you can bring your yoga block in. Heel is elevated. Weight is here, squat, okay? You can also hold it here. Then this same leg will be working again for your deadlift, okay? So let's go with that squat. Three, two, one, here we go. Good work. And you don't have to elevate your heel here, just an option. 15 more seconds. If you started a couple seconds late, just give me two more reps. Good work, four, 
two, one, great job. Now you're likely gonna go heavier for your deadlift, okay? But make sure the right leg is working for you. All right, let's go. Three, two, one, and here we go. You can lift or you can stagger. Totally up to you. Six. Two, one, and rest. Great work. Let's go two more rounds. Rock it on that right leg. Okay, the heel elevated is just to get you in a bigger range of motion for your ankle dorsiflexion or plantar flexion, I mean. Let's go. So you might find with this heel elevation you can go just a bit deeper. Ten. Two, one, great job. <laughs> and we're back to the deadlift. I sometimes just start laughing when the burn sets in a little bit. Go up and wait if you can. Deadlift, right leg, three, two, one, come on. your hips level. Good job, that's a big part of balance. Five. Two, one. All right, last round of these two. Single leg squat, and then close it out with that deadlift. Heel is up, four. Big deep breath, come on. Two, one, let's go. And my other foot is just off to the side. You can take it a little bit behind you. We're out laterally. Sit back and down, push. There you go, let's pulse it out here. Come on, 12, 11. Four. Two, one, good job. Let's hit the deadlift. And then we're gonna do the same circuit on the other leg. Here we go, four, balance or stagger. Let's go. Fifteen. Four. One more, two, one, and rest. Great work. We're only gonna rest 15 seconds because you're doing the same thing on the other leg. All right, so left leg is rocking now. Single leg squat, four, two, one, Let's go. And the other foot, like I said, it can be here, here. Main priority is to stay level over the right or left leg now. Three, two, one, good job, deadlift. Left leg, we're working hard to make it quad dominant on the squat. Okay, now let's take it to the back. Three, two, one, come on. You lose your balance, come right back in. <laughs> let's go. 
stretch, squeeze. Four, two, one, great work. All right, back to the left leg, squat. And anytime you feel like, ah, oh, maybe I could go a little heavier, I want you to do that for yourself. Four, three, two, one, let's go. Fifteen, good work. Three, two, one, great work. Deadlift, and this will close out round two. Just go one more round, and then we move on to some different moves. Ready? Left leg, keep it here, two. Let's go. Fifteen. Three, two, one. Great work. Last round, here we go. I know this burns, or hopefully it burns the last 15 seconds. We're gonna do that pulse again. All right, so let's go. Squat full range, pulse for the last 15. Two, one. Good job. Next squat, sit it down, stay down, right here. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Nine, eight. Come on, work, work, work. Three, two, one. Oh, rest. Good work. Deadlift, last round. And then we'll switch back to the other leg. And we'll have a lunge circuit. I'll show you options. Okay, deadlift. Two, one, let's go. Good work, 15. Two, last one, and rest. <laughs> Beautiful job. Go ahead and grab some water and we're gonna go back to the other leg, okay? We're gonna go forward lunge for your first move. So you're stepping it out and coming back in. Option for that is just keep it out there, up and down, or if you don't feel good with lunges, instead of going here, take that front leg here, back leg is here, and just sit, okay? Second exercise, we're gonna take it out to the side. Lateral lunges, okay? Really want you over top of your quad. That can also be just staying here, okay? Forward lunges, going back to the right leg. First leg, ready? Three, two, one, right leg, let's go. Thirteen. Step out, heel toe. Heel toe sit. Five, four, two. Great job, the one that was just going forward is now going to the side. And you can choose to either stay there or step in and out. Ready? Let's go, two. One, sit, push. Good, and I really want you sitting back in your heel on this one to target your glute, feel the stretch, and squeeze it back up. 
15. Good, and I'm allowing myself to kind of make this 45 degree angle here to really get max glute work. Three, two, one. Great job. If you can go up and wait, let's do it. Forward lunge, right leg. Three, step it out, two, one, let's go. A good focus on this strength workout is gonna get the most out of it for you, okay? I want us to stay working, pushing the whole time. Ten. Two, one, good. Taking it lateral. Now you saw me do a front rack hold on that lateral lunge. That allows me to sit back further. The counterbalance of the weight here allows my hips to go back. So if that would help you, you can do that too. Two, one, let's go. And not that you're not going to feel it in the quad. You're gonna feel it there too, but I want the main focus to be a heel drive glute activation. So get there, push the heel. Get there, push the heel. Good job. Two, one, great work. One last chance to go a little heavier. We're going back for that last round on the right leg. All right, let's lunge it out. Two, one, here we go. There you go. Keep your chest up on this one. Six, five, two, one. Beautiful. Great job. I want those last couple seconds to really be you pushing hard. Let's go lateral. Five. Three, two, sit it down, come on. Heel drive into the floor. Nice work, 15 seconds, come on. Five, really think leg press, come on. Dig the heel in, push, two, one. Great work, we're going 15 seconds and over to the other leg. So you just did all right, let's go all left. Lunge it out, ready? Three, two, let's go. So your leg that was just working so hard is now just kind of hanging back. Great job. This also helps us even out muscle imbalances. So if you have one leg where it's harder to balance or one leg that feels a little stronger, two, one, rest. This is our chance to give it its own attention, okay? You take your time, you focus on good form, and if you need to even it out a little more, do a little extra work on that leg afterwards, but don't view it as weaker. View it as the one you're working hardest in. Lateral, let's go. Good, make sure your heel is straight across from the arch of your other foot. Okay, so if it's back here, then it's gonna feel real weird. If it's way up front, it's also gonna feel weird, okay? Straight out. Two, one. Great work, we go on to round two. Come on, this is just like a chisel away kind of workout. Okay, 30 seconds at a time. You move one leg and you keep your core strong. Lunge it out. Two, one, 
Let's go. Keep your chest up on this one. Ten. Two, one, good work. All right, lateral lunge. This will close out round two. Let me go one more round. You're doing great. Keep pushing, heel straight across from the arch of your foot. Three, two, one, let's go. Keep your knee out. Make sure when you get down there, you don't drive your knee here to come back inside of it. Stay inside the knee. Five, four, two, one, good. Okay, last round, let's get it. Let's crush this last round. You're gonna like the last two circuits, I promise. One exercise is a challenge, but one, I know you're gonna like. Three, lunge it out. Two, one, come on. Good. Heel toe for the landing. Good work. Five. Three, two, one. Lateral lunge. Let's close this one out. And we'll go into split squats and single leg glute bridges. You're doing amazing. Let's go. Four. Three, and let's go. Push the heel in, there you go. Knee out, heel down. 14. One more, three, two, one. Beautiful work. All right, let's go. We've got split squats and a single leg glute bridge, okay? So, we just worked the left leg. Now we go back to the right. 30 seconds here, followed by 30 seconds here, okay? And if you don't have a bench, you're just gonna take your shoulder blades down to the ground or right here. Okay, whatever feels good to you. Whew. Let's go in 15 seconds. We're gonna go left, left, right, right, all the way down. All right, come on, start with that other leg. Two, one, here we go. Thirteen. Two, one, good work. Come on over, glute bridge with that same leg. The one that was out front is the one that's pushing you up in the bridge. Okay, feel free to cross here. You can put a dumbbell here if you want. Three, two, one. Let's go. Fifteen. Good, lots of balance involved here as well. Two, one. Great job, same leg, let's go. Split squat, back up. Four, three, two, 
Let's go. Good, press right into the ball of your foot, the middle of your foot. Seven. Two, one. Back to the glute bridge, come on. Make your way down. If you're going all the way to the floor, that's why you've got time here. Here we go, four. Two, one, let's go. Fifteen, good work. Four, three. Let's go, come on up. <sighs> Last one. Split squats, then we switch it over. You're doing amazing. If you can add weight, go heavier. I want you to do it here. Three, two, one, let's go. Fifteen, good work. Fight for it, fight through it. Six. Three, two, one. Come on down, let's go. Glute bridge. As soon as you get there, you can go right into it if you're ready. Five, three, two, let's get it. 30 seconds here, we rest for 15. After this one's done, go right over to the other leg. Fifteen. Four. Three, two, one. Fifteen seconds. You just worked your right leg. Now we go for the left. Oh, come on up. I'm glad this is the break time for that leg. All right, let's go. Three rounds here and you've made it. Two, one, split. Let's get it. Stay over the front leg. Think of it as a squat in your front leg. 13. Two, one. Oh yeah, let's go. Glute bridge. Four. March or with a dumbbell or cross your leg. Two. One. Quality here, good quality lifts. 15. Three, two, one. Good, come on up. Whew. Split squats. We're going all the way through here. Eight seconds. Get there. Four, three, two, one. Come on. Great work, you're almost at the end here. You got 12 seconds, I don't want you to transition. We're gonna go right into that glute bridge so we can get all three rounds in, okay? We'll give five seconds transition and we'll go, okay? 
into the workout. Rest, down into the glute bridge. Push, push, push. Ready? You get there and you go. Just a little less rest time, same amount of work time. Come on, we got this. If you need to modify, just put the other leg out front a little bit. Great work. Three, two, one, come on up. And we've got 30 and 30. As soon as you get there, let's go. And we'll close it out together. 30 seconds here. 30 seconds glute bridge, and we've made it. Okay, this is your finisher, so just fight through. Fight for it. Good, give me three more and then take it to the bridge. Good, take it to your bridge when you get done with your three. And we'll close it all the way out here. Twelve more seconds, come on. Three, two, one, and rest. Oh, beautiful work. Go ahead and have a seat since we're here already. <laughs> Let's reach it out forward. You've made it to your cool down. Thank you for pushing with me for those last two minutes. Great job. Oh, good, stretch, stretch, stretch. Just kind of let your back round and relax as you breathe to fill it up. Good, take both legs out to the side. Give me two minutes to cool you down here. <sighs> Big exhale. <laughs> that workout was tough. <sighs> it was really a strength driven, stay focused, kind of grind it out workout. As a lot of unilateral work is, you just gotta stay focused. And the good part is, it was really beneficial to our cores. Bring your feet in together so you didn't have to work on Isolating your abs today. Your abs were constantly working to keep your spine straight to protect it. Okay, so dual benefit there for <sighs> unilateral and lower body work. Good. Right leg out straight. Let's cross the left leg over and push it up towards your chest. <sighs> Great job today. So that is day number two of boot camp week. Second workout. Okay, we've got three more boot camp workouts this week. And that style is gonna be what you're gonna see throughout the week, switch legs. Okay, so just showing up, doing antagonistic muscles or different parts of the body muscles or different formats, whether it's one's cardio, one's a strength exercise. <sighs> Great job, make your way back up to standing via a pike so you can get your heels down and walk it back. <sighs> Good, hang out here for five. Three, two, one, and slowly roll it up. Let's get one quad stretch in. If you need to go grab onto a wall, that's totally fine. Pull here. And switch. Great work, and as you head out today, remember your strength in all facets, especially the workouts that challenge you, especially the times of life that challenge you. In those moments, you are ironically getting stronger when you feel the weakest, okay? Strength is built through weakness. It's built through you facing the weakness and overcoming even the mental, but mostly the physical barriers in terms of fitness. <sighs> Good job, hands on your tailbone. So just understanding that out of weakness comes strength. I think that will help us approach everything differently. Good, gentle push. <sighs> nice work. Good job, and as you head out today, I hope you enjoyed this workout. I hope you pushed yourself really hard. 
I enjoyed working out with you. So excited to finally wear my Royal Change merchandise. Love the sports bra, love the detail in the back. It's got the cross back with the Royal Change logo here in the middle. Perfect for strength workouts like this. I felt so comfortable and supported. And then I love to wear shorts for a leg workout just to feel a little bit more breathability in my legs. And we worked them so hard today. So I hope you enjoyed the workout. The launch for all of this apparel that I'll be wearing throughout this week is on Saturday, February 12th at 10 a.m. Eastern. Make sure you check out the description for all the details. Everything going on in the Sydney squad it will be at royalchange.fit. Very proud of you today. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and let me know in the comments below that you crushed it. I'll see you back here tomorrow. Amazing job today. I'm so proud of you for grinding it out with me in that workout. Also very excited to wear my Royal Change strappy sports bra and our four inch inseam workout shorts. All of this will be launching on Saturday, so don't forget to check out the videos and be ready for that launch. I will see you back here tomorrow. Bye everyone. <laughs>